Back in 2008, uh, Run On Sun had a contract with the local utility to come out and do performance assessments of solar power systems that had been installed in the 10 years or so earlier. This was one of the systems that we came out to assess the performance on. At that time, I met the homeowner, Rachel Clark. Yeah, I'm Rachel, and I have lived here for a number of years in this nice neighborhood. I really enjoyed this neighborhood. I got a call from Rachel um, after the, the big windstorm we had here in Pasadena, and she informed me that um, some of her panels had um, come loose from their moorings. And that didn't quite prepare me for what I found when I got here. When we got here, the old system that had been attached to the flat roof back there was just completely torn off. My solar system uh, on the roof was completely destroyed. Jim approached Unirac when this uh, system failure happened. We as assessed the uh, failure and found that there were some um, installation errors, and there's some user errors, or uh, uh, it, it wasn't installed quite properly. I felt like she really needed somebody who could come in and, and kind of make things right for her. So we decided to see what we could do. We spoke with the folks from Unirac to um, bring them into the project and they were very generous in coming out and helping us with this and donating equipment and some of their expertise. I'm happy to say that you know by the time we're done this system is going to be better than it was before. testing the voltage to make sure the panel's generating power before we actually get it on the roof and find out there's a problem. If there's a problem, it's better to find out down here than after it's in place. For the longest time, it's been kind of the wild, wild west uh, in solar, and uh, there hasn't been specific um, practices that have been followed. Uh, we felt this would be a good opportunity to step in and use one of our new systems that does have ICC approval and um, just do install this the right way for this customer. This product that we're installing today on this home is called Solar Mount Evolution. It's very exciting for us. We're, we're excited to move this product forward and we're hoping that um, it's, a, it's a product that changes in the industry and helps all of our competitors and helps the end users uh, build a safer uh, photovoltaic uh, system in the future. You know, her husband had passed a few years earlier and he was the person who had been the driving force behind um, this solar installation and it was pretty apparent to me that this was important to her in a sense that it was sort of a connection to her and her husband. He's done, he's gone beyond what he was really supposed to do and I do so appreciate it. I, I'm very grateful to him. This experience is just one more example of why solar really isn't a do-it-yourself project. This is, this this is, is all it. you need. Yeah, yeah. All this is is, is <laughs> the ability to turn it on and off. I think you're doing a wonderful job and I'm so glad that it's come to the end.